All right, no matter the Fujifilm camera you have, you might have heard of the Fujifilm recipe or film recipes, but you don't know how to do that. This short video is gonna show you how to create a Fujifilm recipe and set it on your camera. So you're gonna hit your menu button and then you have image quality, focus, drive menu. You're gonna be able to change your exposure settings on the image quality uh, tab. So we're gonna start there. And the first thing that a film recipe is built around is a film simulation. So you're gonna to go to film simulation, hit okay. And here you can scroll through the various choices. I'm gonna set one up for, let's see, classic negative right here. That's on most cameras. And then you're gonna have other choices like grain on or off. So I'm gonna put strong and small. Uh, and then uh, color chrome effect. I'm gonna put that strong, uh, strong, and then color chrome FX blue. I'm gonna put that weak. Then uh, white balance. You're gonna set that as well. I tend to like daylight. Uh, and then once you hit OK, you can choose a color shift. So I always like to go a little towards the red and subtract some blue. Dynamic range, you can set that. Tone curve, now here's, if you go negative, you notice uh, it's pulling down your highlights, so it's gonna preserve your highlights. And if you go negative on shadows, you notice it's boosting the shadows. So this is gonna be um, an image where the highlights are reduced, the shadows are boosted, so bringing everything kind of uh, flatter, less contrasty. So if I wanted to increase those shadows, darken them, I might do something like this. Uh, color, this is saturation, so I'm gonna add two there for more satur saturation. You can take the sharpness out of the image and you can take out the high ISO noise reduction. Uh, clarity tends to add processing time onto your images, so um, use it sparingly or in a situation where you're aware that's gonna take your time, uh, your camera processor some time to process. Um, but generally punchy and contrast images with clarity up and negative clarity is a little bit softer of a look. All right, that's it. Now, once those are set, your Fuji camera probably has a custom setting and you can go down on the image quality where it finds edit, save, uh, custom setting where you'll find edit, save, custom setting and you can hit okay. Oops, you can hit to the right. And then you have whatever number of custom uh, buttons available on your camera. You can uh, say save cur current settings into slot two. So I'm gonna save that into slot two, hit it again, and then you can go edit that custom name. And I'm gonna say, um, uh, I haven't tested this, so I don't know what it looks like. I'm just gonna put film and then set that and now on C2, if I hit Q, you'll see film shooting mode. I just named it. It has all those custom things set in there uh, that you could easily see. And uh, let's try a shot out the window with that recipe that I just created. All right, no matter the Fujifilm camera you have, you might have heard of the Fuji film recipe or film recipes, but you don't know.